go over those tiles again? Sure, if that's what you want to do. <laughs> if I want to do it, lie in the sun and watch my grandchildren grow. But there's no sun today. And I have no grandchildren. Yes. Uh, so I think maybe we'll count tiles, huh? Hey, I make a joke, no? What? Uh, excuse me, Grant, but you don't seem so happy as before. I'll live. Better to live happy. Can I help you, my friend? I don't know, Boris. Do you have a cure for confusion? Ah, uh, you've got a decision to make. No, not just one. Maybe I'm confused about everything. Ah, uh, simple. Just tell yourself whatever you decide is right. That's exactly the problem. I don't know what's right and what's wrong anymore. Your heart will tell you. It hasn't so far. <laughs> In our country, Grant, no one is supposed to be rich. Remember? Yeah. And here it's exactly the opposite way around. It's good to have something to strive for. I guess. Just so long as you don't have to compromise your values in the process. If your values are strong, they will stay strong. Hello, Papa. Tanya, what are you doing here? Well, you forgot your lunch. Sorry, oh. I'm late. <laughs> With a thoughtful daughter. Grant, this is my daughter, Tanya. Hello, Tanya. Hi. It's a pleasure. It's so nice to meet you. Well, Papa's talked so much about you. I, I feel like I know you. <laughs> Oh, so I brought you some lunch, too. I hope you don't mind. No, not at all. That was very thoughtful of you. Nothing. You're wrong. As a matter of fact, I think you just restored my faith in simple gestures. Excuse me? Nothing. Uh, come, let us eat, huh? <laughs> Your father tells me you work at General Hospital. Yes, I'm a respiratory therapist. Mm. It's funny that we never met while I was there. I do remember seeing you, though. I'm uh, sorry we never had a chance to talk. Well, that's all right. It feels more right now, anyway. Besides, back then I probably never would have offered you cabbage soup. <laughs> True. I guess timing is everything. Don't make excuses for your shyness, Tanya. Uh, Papa. Would you like some more soup? Yeah, I, I would love some. It's absolutely delicious. Oh, I'll help myself. For an American-born girl, she uh, cooks like she's from the old country, mm -hmm. huh, Grant? Mm -hmm. Because it's the only thing you'll eat, Papa. Oh. I know my customer. <laughs> <laughs> my heart is all American, but my stomach doesn't know it yet. <laughs> <laughs> After 22 years, I'm trying to change that. Yeah. It's funny, the few good memories I have of the homeland when I was a child, are just exactly like these. Good family, friends, and good simple food. Mine too. Especially the food. And my childhood friends. My relatives, I... I miss them. Now, Pop, don't go getting sentimental on us. Well, it's not easy finding friends here who really understand. Is it, Grant? Oh! <laughs> but now I have a new friend. And we live in a much better country. And the food is still good. <laughs> well, the food is good. The company is good. Life is good. Life is good, Boris. <laughs>